the main objective of uh, the creation of the multi-agency coordinating committee and likewise of the Committee on Security, Peace and Order and Emergency Preparedness and Response us is to secure the delegates and most especially the heads of states who are coming to attend the ASEAN summit against militant groups and uh, all lawless element who wanted to disrupt and create trouble during the event. We employed and asked Interpol General Secretariat to deploy the Interpol major event support team in our country for this particular event, the ASEAN Summit, wherein uh, 10 ASEAN member countries and uh, other uh, head of states are coming. And uh, it was indeed a success because uh, of our cooperation with each other. Before uh, hand, uh, of course, we have uh, prepared for this particular event. That is why uh, our county created the Committee on Security, Peace and Order and Emergency Preparedness and Response. And out of this committee, the creation of the multi-agency coordinating committee was established wherein all law enforcement agencies are involved, including the Philippine Center on Transnational Crime and Interpol. We had been preparing for this event and of course PCTC, Interpol NCB Manila, played an important role in uh, crafting the security preparation for uh, this event. We were able to employ almost all of uh, the Interpol tools in this uh, operation, such as the I-24-7, which is uh, a reliable source of information and exchange of uh, intelligence uh, gathering. And uh, the database, of course, of uh, the uh, stolen lost travel document and the notices of Interpol. We employed them and uh, of course it uh, brought uh, those tools brought us uh, a remarkable uh, operations and at the same time lead us to a successful conduct of uh, the ASEAN summit in our country.